Hey everyone, it's Cam here, and guys, today this is going to be a total different video from what I usually do. And um, this sub, I'm going to have a subject, and I'm just going to speak about this, this subject is lucid dreaming, L-U-C-I-D dreaming. Some of you may have heard of it, you may have not, but I'm going to try my best to explain what it is and what it does. Right, my fr my friend Mike in real life, friend Mike, like my best friend Mike. He introduced me to it yesterday by sending me a forum link to, on the tech game, you know, a gaming modding site, and it it fascinated me. What I, I'll do my best to explain in words how you can do it. It's it's the way you go to sleep in a certain way, but you tell your mind to stay awake. You keep thinking, stay awake, stay awake. It's just try and stay awake, and as you do this, your body. You will think your brain will send signals to your body to say that just to just shut down, like go to sleep. It send a signal, for instance, an itch to move your eyes to change your position. I mean, it, it do that, and you've got to ignore everything it does, everything your body is telling you, and just concentrate on trying. To, you've got to have your eyes closed. You just got to try and stay awake. I mean, right now that's what that's how you start it really. Now I'll explain what what kit uh, what it can do. Once, if you do it right, it takes it takes practice to do. You control your dream. I mean, you will wake up in your room, completely. You feel it. It's real vivid. Everything. Everything is there, as you would picture it. But for instance, you can check if you're in a lucid dream by switching. If you put like in your room, say you have a light, you flick it. Um, if it doesn't turn on a light, you are in a dream. You are in a lucid dream, a real dream, and you can do anything you want. Anything you can think of, it will be there. Like, like your god, really. You can do anything you want. Dream Megan Fox there with her ass open. Down there you go. It, it would happen. I'm just saying, I know that's a pretty cool example, but it would happen. But the downsides of this are, whilst you are going into this, you do hear noises, you hear footsteps, you hear things you wouldn't hear because you, your mind is not, it's, tr it's trying to go to sleep and it's picking up things you don't even know. I mean, I tried this last night and I scared the fuck out of myself. I, I got it and I heard voices, I heard bells, I heard all sorts of shit. It scared the fuck out of me and I heard a voice say wake up and if you wake up whilst you are trying to do it, you go into something called sleep paral paralysis or something like that, like paralyzed but paralysis. I don't know how you say it. And it's where you're awake, but your eyes are closed, and you cannot move. You cannot move anything. You hallucinate. You see stuff. You see things that are not there, just in your imagination. I mean, I did that, and I shit myself. I know I was sleeping, but. It, it's like you're there. You cannot move. You can try as hard as you want. You cannot move a muscle, a limb. You cannot move anything. It, it's so scary if you do it wrong. But the thing that people say is to not look at a mirror. If you look at a mirror, you do not see yourself. You're like a vampire. You, you look in a mirror, you do not see your own reflection, and you panic, and you think of bad things, and then they show up on the mirror. <coughs> oh, my voice just went. Like, say... If anyone's seen the Grudge film, just imagine something bad, and you saw you you looked at the mirror, you saw you, you saw you couldn't see yourself. You you'd be like, oh my god, you'd panic, you'd think of something bad, and be like, what's going on? And it will be there, and it will feel so real, unbelievably real. I mean, I didn't get this far, but I did. I just couldn't move in my bed, and I was panicking. I was scaring myself. I mean, that's the downsides to it. But over time, you start to learn, and that's a real it. It's it's really fascinating thing. Does the human the human mind the brain how it works? I mean, it fascinated me, and it probably will fascinate you because it's an amazing thing that it's it's so easy to do. I mean, but me, I, I'm still gonna try it, even though that time. But just imagine, you do anything you want. You can fly. I know it sounds absolute freaking stupid, but you can fly. You can do anything you can ever imagine in your dream. It's your dream. You can choose anything. Whatever you think of, bang, you do it. I mean, <laughs> it's absolutely amazing what you can do, but just that effect of doing it wrong, waking up, you've just got to ignore and just just stay focused on trying to stay awake. 
I mean, there's many checks for it and stuff to see if you are there, what you can do. I mean, there's a gravity check. You throw something up a few times and just see if you can catch it. Because, I mean, it will be like real life. It will be exactly like real life. Um, but it is just a dream. Um, I know this is pretty weird, but I just really thought I'd um, express this with you because it, it's something that really rocked my world, shall I say. Um, I'm not telling you to try it because it may scare some of you. It did scare me. Um, reading about it, it looked it looked so good, but I did read people like um, scare. It has scared them. Uh, people do want to try. It. I do want to try it again. I want to try and get a proper dream, and I can just. I mean, I guess people do it if they're kind of stressed. I'm not saying I'm stressed or anything. It's just um, it's what people do if they're. I know they're upset. Something like that. I mean, they go to their own dream world, do whatever they want. Everything is theirs. I mean, just imagine that, guys. Just imagine right now what you could do with anything. Anything you wanted. I mean, you could... You, the same instance, this might be pretty sad, but you could go onto RuneScape. You could type in any username you wanted. You could type in SparkMac. You could type in any password you wanted. You would log in. You could imagine your bank. It'd be like a private server, but you would think it's real. You could imagine players, you can imagine hits, anything, it it would be there. I mean, this is so amazing, guys, what you can do. I'm waiting for my friend Mike to get on MSN because I want to see if he got anything out of it because I know I did and it wasn't too good, but it it was an amazing experience, guys. I'm, I really want to do it again, but I know you, you damn, you're fucking crazy, man. What, what's wrong with you? I mean, it. I, I didn't think it would work at first, um, nor did some of my friends, they were just like, nah, it wouldn't work, that's just fake, just fake, meh, meh, but it, it did work, and I got the, the downside of it, but I'm going to say, be careful with what you think of, just try not to think of, well, I mean, go in, think of happy stuff, just every single time, happy, 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 because if you think of bad, it switches it around unbelievably fast, and you just got to stay awake, um, I, know, I don't know if you guys would want one of these or not, but I don't really make videos like these. I'm just PKing all the time, but I just thought I had to share it with some of you because it is a really weird experience. Really weird. But, I don't know, guys. I don't think I can think of much left to say about it, really. It's it's, it's a worldwide thing. Every Loads of people do it. I mean, I don't know why, but as I said, maybe depressed or something like that. Um, it is crazy. It, it's one of those things. It would affect. It affects you if you try it, and it is worth trying, a hundred percent. If you just type it in on Google, you will get results. Um, it's like a definition where, it, well, the definition of it is like pretty much you catch yourself in a sleep, in a dream. You catch yourself, so you are. Sa, what what would it be called? I'm trying to think of what it would be called. The protagonist. You'll be the protagonist of yourself in the dream. You play as yourself, you think as yourself, you think you're there. But I mean, just don't think of bad things when you're in there because it, it will happen as your mind. You've got to be careful with it. Let's just see what he wants. You've got to be careful. I mean, it, it's not going to kill you. I think it, if you end up somehow dying in your dream, you wake up. There's many ways to wake up, like shouting. Um, I can't remember, Mike's told me some shouting, trying to fall through your bloody bed. Nope, I ain't giving you fucking money. Um, I mean, uh, <laughs> I may sound like a fucking witch or something, but I'm just saying it. it, it what the fuck are you? Okay, I'm gonna get like a free uh, 600k here. But. Okay, I just got raped in the face. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm just trying to talk about lucid dreams here. Oh god, that's funny. What? Why? Why did, why did you do that anyway? Okay, I don't give a fuck. Because um, usually people just ask you for money all the time. Um, so guys, I really can't think of anything to say. It's just a, it's a weird experience. Um, you may think I'm fucking crazy. You just look it up. Just, just maybe try it yourself. I mean, it is worth doing, in my opinion. So just remember, just you got to stay positive when you're doing it. Do not wake up halfway through like I did, and 
you hallucinate, you can't move, you're fucked really, and you just gotta, you gotta really try just to ignore all of what's there to try and wake up, you gotta ignore everything your body tells you, you gotta become yourself, really. I don't know what he's gonna do, I bet he'll give someone a fucking party at. Okay, guys, I, I can't think of much else to say, I hope you listen to it and listen to my story, what I had, and it was a good experience in my opinion, but I'm gonna try it again soon. You may think I'm crazy, but just trust me, I'm not. You probably just like this fucking video.